recording because I think there's something cool over here, but I'm not sure you're going to be able to see it. Look at it. Look at those trucks. It looks like the elephants at the circus. <laughs> That's so ridiculous. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. We're going to go buy Toys R Us because we haven't been in here in a little bit. And I think Avengers toys are probably out now. And Star Wars. They do have a bunch of new uh, Avengers Ultra movie uh, Legos, so check this out. And this, and this, and this, the Quinjet, that's amazing. Oh, and this. I might just have to hold this box as we walk around, just in case. <laughs> it's the last it's one. pretty cool. <laughs> Scarlet Witch is in here too. You know, it's funny, a couple of years ago, we got Jesse Minecraft Legos in a tiny little Lego box, right? I got that two years. Yeah, and it was a small little box. Yeah. And they were like little squares. And they were very difficult to get. But now they've got Minecraft everything in Lego. But Super giant the things. Like this thing. It's 120 $70. I don't think they have the little boxes anymore. Nope. Hmm, collector's items. Yeah. You got one or two of them. One. Mm -hmm. I have three. You have one? Oh, one out of three. So much Legos. They have a toss across Star Wars version and these room lights that are lightsabers. I could totally get this. <laughs> oh yeah. So we're at Zoomies because Jesse's gonna follow in my footsteps. Not Mary, but she is going to get a helmet. Aww, arm in arm, going to Chipotle. Hey, we just finished eating Chipotle, by the way. I found out that I am super crazy about the order of ingredients that need to go into a bowl. So, um, there was hardly anybody in there, but I ordered a steak bowl and then they just like start putting, um, you know, they have the hot stuff first, but who puts, you know, like sour cream and cheese on and then salsa on top of it? I do not want it that way. I'm super nuts now all of a sudden. <laughs> but the other thing to think about, that place, there was nobody in there and it was filthy. So, I thought about treating a Chipotle, but what's the point? So, it's filthy. No ice in the thing. No lemons for your uh, tea. Oh, what the heck. Hey, by the way, while I'm on just a slight rent tear here, um, you know, folks, I love when everybody comments and you either like or dislike videos, and I'm not sure if everybody knows how YouTube works, but, um, you know, you get hits based off of, you know, obviously the amount of views that you're getting, um, as opposed to the comments that are tied to videos there's a secret sauce formula in there somewhere but um, it's funny that, you know there's you know there's haters and there's folks that um, do want to do nothing but put like um, negative comments sometimes and that's cool I answer those too um, or thumbs down but you know if I'm putting a video out about Disney and it's basically just going to the park and watching it you put a thumbs down on that because there's some folks that put thumbs down on it all of my videos or Tim's videos or you know I look at Mike Warbuck's channel anybody's channel thumbs down thumbs down all the time the only thing that you're really doing when you're putting a thumbs down and you're actually watching this right now so you can just get the, the point um, you're giving us a video view so thanks for the thumbs down it sounds crazy but by watching the video or clicking the video and clicking the ad you're putting money in my pocket so thanks we stopped at Walmart <laughs> now Jesse's a rainbow a into a pot of gold, gold. Now we're down to bows. <laughs> it's a four-leaf clover. <laughs> <laughs> I can't imagine who wore that before you. I know. Wait, wait. Here's a fun fact. When we got married, we had an 80s theme wedding and we gave out Rubik's Cubes as party favors. And now they're back. I didn't tell you guys last week, but they filmed a scene with me in Sharknado 3. And now here's the outtake. I don't feel so good. <laughs> Two. These are the supposed uh, uses for these noodles. Look at this. A headrest, or a flexible tray, or a tablet easel, of course. <laughs> By the way, Jesse's skateboard wheels light up when they spin. <laughs> I'm sure that adds extra function. I don't know how long the lights will last. They look like little LEDs in there. That's really cool. <laughs> I like it. We'll go break our arms tomorrow. Yay! Oh, look at this. Mary made an Irish soda bread. And it's not for us, I don't think. Oh, boy. I want some of that. 
Uh, correction, it is for us. See, Mary's making stuff. Jesse's got a school project about heritage, and she's got to do stuff about Ireland for Mary's side of the family, and they're making what kinds of good food, and I guess we get to taste test stuff before the class gets it. Yay! Hey, we got these crazy peeps today. Mystery chicks. Are they sweet? Salty? Savory? Zesty? Savory? Fruity? Tangy? Who knows? We'll have to try them. Ooh! Oh. And check this out. Abita made root beer. Uh, we love Abita beers, so I'm really interested in tasting this. Mm -mm -mm. Mary outdid herself with this soda bread. Yay! I think we're going to go outside for a minute because they're supposed to be launching a uh, SpaceX rocket up. And I'm going to see what we can see from the sky out here. It's kind of cloudy outside and very foggy tonight, but let's take a look. It is so foggy out here, so I'm not sure how much we're going to see of anything. Especially clear at least. You can see like even the street lights all wrapped around in fog. Uh, is that it down there? That's it. Where? Right above the house? Mm hmm. That's been glowing since we walked out. Okay, that's not it. I think that's it. Well, it did go up, but all we saw was what happened behind the house there and Jesse in the reflection of the TV. But this is what it looked like on TV, at least. Well, that's what it looked like on TV. We just really couldn't see anything this time around. So while we didn't get to go see the launch tonight out in the driveway, I can tell you that next week on March 12th, I got invited by NASA to get up to Kennedy Space Center and to take in a whole day of uh, media events, including getting up close and, uh, for the launch at night. They're doing a night launch next week on the 12th. I think it's like 10.50 p.m. Um, but we're going to be able to interview astronauts, talk to the NASA engineers and the scientists that work out there. Um, it's one of these rare events that they um, open up for social media. Um, they allow like 50 or so uh, people out there um, from across the country to these events. And we got selected, so we'll be out there and hopefully get uh, launch footage a little closer than what we got the last time when we were out at New Smyrna Beach. So it's going to be really awesome. All right, we're going to try these mystery peeps. I have to do the trying because Mary and Jesse are repulsed by these peeps or any peeps. So. I think they're minty. Uh, no, fruity. It's sugary. They're definitely fruity. Almost like um, kind of like starbursty. However, the Abita, uh, I was going to say the Abita roast beef, the Abita root beer is quite good. It's really delicious. Well, Sunday is over, Walking Dead's over, and we caught up on an episode of the Metal Show also, or that Metal Show. So, Walking Dead, it's alright. I still think it's kind of a chore to watch every week, but, you know, it is what it is. It reminds me a lot more of Lost as every episode goes on this season too by the way so and I'm not gonna say that for reason why because I'm not gonna blow spoilers for people but anyway I'm heading off to sleep so thanks for all the likes and the comments and the subscriptions treat others the way you want to be treated have a great night we'll see ya